Hello, and welcome to Geneva's Integrated Media Center. I'm Megan Schoenweiss here with your athletic weekly update. Men's basketball earned a program's first sweep against the Bethany Bison in last week's road win. Congratulations to the men's basketball program on that historical accomplishment. Now 9-10 overall in 6-6 six six in the PAC, the Golden Tornadoes are on the road Wednesday facing Teal at 7.30 p.m. The men return home to host the Thomas More Saints at 4 p.m. on Saturday. The coaching staff will be featuring blue puzzle piece pins on their wardrobe during the home match on Saturday in support of Autism Speaks, which is an autism awareness organization. The women's basketball program welcomed back head coach Lori Wynn to the sidelines on Saturday. The team, campus, her friends, family, and community has been able to surround Coach Wynn with prayers and support since July when she was diagnosed with ovarian cancer. Coach Wynn still has more chemo treatment scheduled, but was able to join the team this week during the PAC's conference-wide Win the Battle campaign. We continue to pray for Coach Wynn during her last stretch of recovery. The women's basketball program will be also be at Teal on Wednesday and host Thomas Moore on Saturday. The men and women's indoor track and field teams each broke records this past weekend at the Spire Midwest Open. On the track, Geneva's distance medley relay team set Geneva's school record to 10 minutes and 53 seconds. In the field, Isaac Beringer shook up the book, placing seventh in the men's weight throw, setting the school record to 14.6 meters. In women's action, Nicole Bartoletta tied her record in the 60 meter hurdles, placing fourth overall with her time of 9.06 seconds. Also competing in the 200 meter dash, she reset the school record to 26.49 seconds. It was Nicole's third straight meet affecting the school's record book. The indoor track and field Golden Tornadoes will be at Mount Union on Saturday to compete in the Jim Wusk Invitational. Events begin at 11 a.m. That's all we have for today, and I hope to see you all next time.